There should be a way going to this cave, right? Oh, there's a secret here. I see. <laughs> there you go. All right, hold on. I can't see anything. Okay. Hello, friend. Snack here and welcome back to Hello Farm. Alrighty, look at that. We have our pumpkins ready, the corn also, and uh, our one and only sunflower. Looking good. And look at that, guys. Our jellies are ready. We got two grape jelly and seven blackberry jelly from that awesome huh so let's just preserve more blackberry since we've gathered a lot of them oops not mean to eat that oh i'm so sorry thank you i didn't mean to forget about you i was just too excited with the blackberry jelly okay mary lewis has given us spaghetti thank you so much and also hey from marnie thank you my boy hello at the as of the moment by the way guys we uh our coop is under construction where it's being expanded and look at that, our mayo machine, uh, we have six total, right? So if you look at the upper right hand corner or upper left hand corner, um, we have a new uh, goal, which is to expand a coop, which is ongoing right now. Uh, expand a barn, expand a house for a kitchen, I think, and then a stable. And while on the process of doing so, well, we might also need to craft some toppers crab pots so we could maximize our income since it's almost winter man winter is coming so this few days from now hello co they're so happy as always more milk milk please <laughs> so even though it's gonna be winter there's no crops at least we'll have some crab pots topper and we can also go fishing can't wait it'll be fun right and our egg is going straight to our mayo machine oh i forgot i almost forgot to set free our big cows Hello, come out. Don't be shy. Say hi to everyone. There you go. Hello. <laughs> and finally, guys, it's time to harvest our beautiful pumpkins and also some corn. Look at that. And our bees right here are busy making honey. So let's just put one uh, pumpkin in our gift chest in case someone uh, is asking for it. And I think the rest is going to go straight to our shipping bin. All right. Now what to do next? Oh, we need to water these plants also. <laughs> sorry sorry about two of you yeah it's two of them almost forgot to water them okay looking good in our farm so now since we are planning to craft some uh, d d crab pots and also we need to expand our barn uh, let's just gather some wood because i think a crab pot requires 25 wood um barn i don't think it will i think barn requires more than 400 wood because expanding the coop, coop requires 400 wood, but the barn is bigger, so it should require more wood than the coop. I'm just assuming things, by the way. <laughs> I really don't know. And oh, today, by the way, guys, is uh, Spirit Eve Day, and uh, I haven't really experienced it yet. It's gonna be my first time. Pretty sure it's gonna be fun and maybe a bit mysterious, because it's about spirit, right? And also, again, thank you so much for you guys watching me enjoy the game. I appreciate that and uh, if you're new here uh, please feel free to like and subscribe as that would really help our channel grow and uh, also if you look at the lower right hand corner we only have like 20 percent energy left and it's still uh 3 p.m we still have time and we've run out of stamina so we might we might just go ahead and clean up stuff with a scythe get some hay to fill in our silo i think there's still some few space left in our silo okay that's it all right let's just clear this space here since these weeds are almost about to invade our uh plants or crops i think our hay is full and hey, look at that guys our mayonnaise are ready <laughs> this is what i love about mayonnaise they, they they're very quick there you go all right looks like our farm animals are going home before 6 p.m <laughs> all right looks like our hay is full we are more than ready for winter except that we don't have a greenhouse yet because you know i haven't really uh focused on the community center i've been focusing on how we uh expand our farm so we could uh have money and also i wanted to for our farm to at least look presentable for grandpa at least it won't look that empty and also we have our mushrooms here i almost forgot Aha, uh -huh. there you go. We have some moral and some com common mushroom. Wow, we have like six to seven common mushroom, guys. Oh man, look at that. This uh, golden star mayonnaise, 45 of them. Its cost is actually 12,000. That's a lot of money. <laughs> we could use that to expand our operations. Okay, it's 7 p.m. Mm, got nothing to do. We'll just head straight to the town. Mm, okay, we're too early for the festival. It's gonna be like 10 p.m. Let's just wait. Uh, We could continue 
cutting woods or chopping woods we'll just eat this wild plum and hazelnut these guys are very handy so let me just check what profession i have chosen um uh, let's see so we've chosen the tiller profession for the crops the miner the gatherer a trapper and then for the combat the scouts all righty so i'm gonna have to focus more on the crops although i have fun more with uh tending to the animals because you know animals are moving they're lively they they say hi to you if you say hi to them you need to pet them all the time but uh, uh for now let's just uh i was actually thinking when i was deciding on which which profession to choose between uh the teller and uh i don't know what is called the animal person <laughs> Uh, I was thinking of, uh, I wanted to have more money because I think uh, you'll get more money with the crops. But now I'm thinking uh, I love tending to the animals more than tending to the crops. So uh, that's fine. I can still tend to the animals though. It's just uh, an additional uh, perk or benefit. It won't mean that much. 9.20 p.m. It's almost 10. I can't wait, man. I wonder what, what's, what will happen in the Spirit Festival. Again, it's getting me my first time to experience it like totally. Like Stardew Valley has been, you know, it's been out for like, uh, I think it's going to be the sixth year, if I'm not mistaken. And uh, it's my very first time to experience the festival. Okay, after this, we're going to go straight to the town square. Uh, it's time to begin. Let's go, guys. Let's go. And here we are. Look at that. Ooh. This is fun, but a bit scary because there's some skeletons here, I think. I think Marlon caught them and displayed them for what? For the purpose of the festival? Man, that's scary. Okay, let's head to Marlon. Don't get too close to the cage. Yeah, I know, right? They're very dangerous. Oh, there's more here. Oh, it's a maze. Uh-huh. Let's see. Hello. Oh, wait, wait. What's this? Oh, she's a bloody lady. Wait, wait. Who are you? Oh, it's uh, Maru. <laughs> I think I've already been this. I've been this way. No, wait. <laughs> okay, Maru is kind of, kind of lost. Uh, how about this? Who's this guy here? He's just facing the wall. He's given up. Oh, this is Harvey. Oh, you found me. Yep. The truth is I got too scared, so I came here to hide. Don't tell anyone, of course. Oh, what are these? These are hands. <laughs> this is fun. Oh, there's also a TV here. Oh, what the heck is this? There's a house with a chicken feet. <laughs> and we have here Penny. Oh, it's such a nut. This is a wonderful or oh, not wonderful, but a scary uh, zombie. The vapor from this cauldron, it's making my head spin, but I can't seem to leave. Oh, oh really maybe you're under a spell okay there is a chest here oh we need to go inside the cave okay uh let's go let's let's find a way towards the cave we have a tv here all right what's the tv doing here on who's this guy oh alex is a superhero there's something weird over there but how do i get to it me too i'm asking there's got to be a secret passage somewhere around here all right let's let's see if we could get to that passage and we have here abigail haha <laughs> nice She's looking good. Oh, these are huge spiders. But we have a graveyard right here. We have a... Oh, Sam. <laughs> Sam, you look cool, bro. You're a scare, Sam. I could have sworn there was someone ahead of me when I went through the maze, though. Where'd they go? I think they went here inside a cave. So there's a question mark here. There should be a way going to this cave, right? Oh, there's a secret here. I see. <laughs> there you go. All right, hold on. I can't see anything. Okay, we're going under the ground. Look at this. There's actually first Modius and uh, Linus at the top. And we are here, guy. Oh, okay. These are just bats. They're not doing anything. Oh, wonderful. We have a golden pumpkin. Golden pumpkin, guy. Wow. What does it say? Golden pumpkin is valuable, but has no other purpose. It's just 2,000 gold, man. That should go uh, directly to our uh, um, collections. So basically, the Spirit Festival is like Halloween in uh, Stardew Valley. Alrighty, we've successfully completed the maze. Oh, Jazz is so adorable here. <laughs> yep, I had a productive fall. Oh, we have Haley here. Why? Wow, she looks so sad. I guess she's scared. Is Sam or Alex was so busy checking out the chest. <laughs> okay, we have a shop from Perry. Unfortunately, we don't have that much gold for the rare crow. I should have known, right? Maybe we can save up for next year. <laughs> All right, let's say hi to Sebastian. Oh, he's a vampire. I had no idea how these skeletons are walking creepy. Oh, they were using their feet. That's why they walk. Shane is uh, a skeleton. Why is there no more pumpkin ale? We also have Clint here. He's a clown. <laughs> One of my... Ir iridium infused mesas would make quick work for these things okay and we have here leia oh i'm sorry moth is full of blackberries <laughs> oh she loves blackberries that's good that's good to know and we have here 
Uh, hey, Emily. Hello, Emily. You look funny. Caroline. Wow, she looks awesome. I get scared very easily. I'll leave the hunted maze to the younger people. I'm sure. Also, Judy. Wow. Vincent's upset that I won't let him go into the hunted maze, but he's just a little boy. By far, Judy has the best ghost uh, custom ever. And Mayor Lewis, as always, he's like, his dress is a noble. Good evening, Snacku. Have you ventured into the hunted maze yet? It's quite spooky. Yeah, I've actually got the golden pumpkin. And Vincent here. Look at that. You're like Peter Pan. Yeah, mother won't let me go into the maze. <laughs> it's okay, my boy. And who's here? Oh, Pam. I'll come to any event with a free rub. Okay, let me take it back. Pam has the best costume ever. Second is uh, Jody. And uh, Elliot uh, is like the uh, circus master. And Gus is a Viking. Cool, dude. Very cool. It's a lot. A lot of fun to cook with pumpkins, such an interesting fruit. And Robin is here. <laughs> she's like one of the Adams family. And Demetrius, totally. You haven't seen Maru in hours, I hope she's alright. She's lost in the maze. <laughs> okay, uh, that was fun. Uh, meeting everyone on their own costumes. Uh, I think we'll start the... Yeah, let me just eat a little bit. I'm a bit hungry. Yum, yum, yum. And then let's start the... That strange man who lives in the tower set it all up himself. He wouldn't let anyone near while he was working on it. I think he used magic to set it up. Oh, Res oh yeah, we need to go uh, to Rasmodius and also Linus. Okay, can we start the festival or is this it? Alrighty guys, I think we were done here. I've had my uh, tummy full and uh, said hi to everyone and had fun in the maze. Looks like, uh, let's see. I was thinking of there's going to be a, a, a game like uh, uh, Mayor Lois also always do. Okay, uh, we can actually leave. Okay. Alright guys, bye bye. Thanks for it. Thanks for your time. Thanks. Have fun. I have to go. I still need to tend to the farm early morning. Wow, that was fun. We got a golden pumpkin, as you can see here. Although we're not able to buy the rare crow. I don't know about that. If I've known, I could have saved up 5,000 gold. Uh, that's okay. Let's just fill up this mayonnaise or mayo machine. And that is it. Just in time. It's 1 a.m. Let's head straight to bed. Good night. Thank you. And wow, look at that, guys. We got 6,000 gold. Wow, from pumpkins. Okay, let's remember that. Pumpkin is very profitable. Good morning. It's the 20th day of fall. I think today is the last day, right? And we've learned how to cook an artichoke dip. It's a delightful way to get more artichokes into your body. Personally, I don't have even even dip anything in there. I just guzzle the sauce down. It's like a milkshake. Okay. It's gonna be a sunny day tomorrow. Alrighty. And we got fried eel recipe from george thank you for that grandpa george and our mayonnaise are here do you think we'll just sell all of them now no i don't think so we don't need that much money yet we'll just store them and more mayonnaise coming right up hello chickens and look at that robin is currently working on our coop hello guys i'm sure you're very happy but it's almost winter by the way just saying so you'll be prepared you'll be eating hay all the time hopefully you don't mind guys my 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 uh cow friends i'll get used to it don't worry thank you for the milk i think the happier the animal the farm animals the better uh things they produce right oh we have more pumpkins here <laughs> so for the honey uh there's one more day to go hopefully uh, i'm not sure if, if it's gonna make it on time because it's gonna be winter We'll, we'll see about it. All right, let's prepare. Let's get some wood. Because right after the poop upgrade, we'll head straight away on the barn upgrade. While in the process of doing so, we'll see if we could upgrade the topper and a crab pot or craft them. So now we're gathering um, materials like wood, stone, pepper. Well, yesterday, the costumes was very interesting. Like like all through the, the costumes, the personality of our fellow town folks really shine. Like for Abigail, she likes adventuring. So her costume was, uh, she was a knight. But Sam's kind of weird because <laughs> Sam chose the costume Scarecrow. <laughs> and Sebastian, his uh, costume is a Dracula, which I figured. And for me, the craziest one was actually Pam. <laughs> She's like a zombie, but she has, she had this knife stuck in her head. <laughs> And the next one is like uh, Jody. She's like Maleficent, which really fits her. Because I think she's one of the, you know, if I may say it here, she's one of the most the prettiest mom in the valley. Uh, that's Jody. So her costume really fits her. The Maleficent costume, that is. Looks like we have little trees growing. Nice. And now it's like 12 p.m. All right, if you look at the lower right hand corner, we have like 10% of our stamina left. Um. Oh, what to do with this so we'll just gather oh wait let me just open it up 
open it up forgot to free our cows looks like we've run out of eggs man good thing we're about to expand our coop okay we can craft a crab pot and let's see if we could also craft a topper now which we can't yet oh we also have here a keg okay uh place a fruit or vegetable in here eventually it will turn into beverage oh we can make beer but we can't do that yet because it's gonna be a winter we don't have vegetables or anything that we could put in there um for winter let me think uh for winter uh we, we'll we'll just work with uh crabs and tappers and also do fishing so that means we're gonna prepare and craft a bait and uh with the bait uh linus actually has given us this bait here a wild bait which requires a fiber and five bug meat okay so i think um oh might need to head to the mines it's 2 p.m uh can we go to the mines now uh, i want to say hi to the people i miss the people in pelican town <laughs> Let's just stop by our, uh, the crab pot spot and then, uh, say hi to everyone. Or maybe talk to Leia and uh, Abigail. Because since we have an amethyst and also a salad, pretty sure they will love it. And we have Mr. Mayor here. Hello, Mr. Mayor. How are you doing? And we have Abigail. It's a perfect man. There you go. Are you serious to love this? Yes, I know, right? What should I do tonight? Maybe, uh, let me think. Maybe stargazing. It's gonna be awesome, right? Yes, what it is. Stargazing. All right, see you. Oh, that's a very nice gift. <laughs> and it's too old for Mayor Lewis. That voiceover is, uh, <laughs> it is a disaster. Okay, we have like four crab pots. Okay. Uh, and, and then, uh, let's see. Uh, we have 8,000 gold. Actually, we cannot buy any crops. Uh, let's just uh, do some uh, foraging, right? Yeah, why not? Let's clean up this uh place and we have here the traveling merchant hello what do you have for us dandelion is 700 gold oh, you're awesome man this traveling merchant is awesome like he really knows when opportunity strikes he's really a businessman right oh i know i know i uh, need to upgrade our axe oh abigail is always staying here i wonder why hmm okay let's hold her hand and Tell her that she looks great and tell her that we'll stay by her side forever, I think. <laughs> oh man, Leia is gonna kill us. Anyway, um, I don't know yet. I will have to choose for, between Leia and uh, Abigail. Now, let's say hi to her small. It's been a while, it seems. I sometimes observe the local villagers in secret. That's crazy. I'm hoping as I find an apprentice someday, I will leave this mortal plane, but my arcane pursuits must continue. Okay. Looks like this place is uh, totally empty. There's no forageables. It's okay. It's good to, you know, take a little walk just to get a breather from work, clear up your mind. I wonder what's in here. This sewer. Hmm. I don't know yet, but we'll, we'll see. Hey, Sam, here's some blackberry for you. You've got that for me. Okay. Yeah, it's like everyone loves blackberries except for jazz. It's hard to have fun on Sunday. I keep thinking about having to go to work tomorrow. Yeah, right. Everyone does that. If Even me. That's why I don't think about it. It's the only way to, you know, to get away from that kind of feeling. Oh, we have a bread. Okay. Hey, Gus. Buddy, how are you doing? I do have work to do. I'm done, though. All right. Looks like everyone is having fun this is great thanks oh shane loves blackberries nice and uh how about uh clint he also loves blackberries Miney, of course she likes it and pam as well also gus wonderful and emily uh, she looks so pretty see you everyone and the best way to end a fall is to do some late night fishing let's see what we will get in the last hours if i'm not mistaken because it's 28 and i think it's gonna be winter tomorrow we have a chop at the stars guys they look so beautiful if you're wondering this is actually the reflections mod that i've installed that's why you can see the reflection of the stars also my reflection in the water also i've installed the uh, wind effect mod just to you know to pair it with a reflections mod to make the game more immersive it's 11 p.m and we got ourselves a oh a midnight carp this is new okay we have a chest nice let's get the chest and the fish awesome we have a bullhead and also a magma geode and an iron what a lucky find now we're exhausted i think it's gonna be the last fish for the night it's also very late so after this we'll just uh, head straight home and we're gonna try something else that we haven't tried yet maybe and there you go Oh, another midnight carp. Let's go. And finally, our toppers, pine tar. We also have a pine tar. Everything is pine tar here. That's why I planted new seeds here, actually. Look at this. Uh, I think these are maple trees, hopefully. 
And also the mushroom, I always forget, man. How many times I forgot this mushroom? Like every day I forget. Okay. Alrighty. By the way, guys, for more videos, you can look at the lower left hand corner of your screen. Again, thank you so much for uh, hanging out. And if you're new here, please feel free to like and subscribe. And always remember to be patient and kind to one another because that is what love is. See you in the next video.